What's going on guys, it is Andrew here and welcome back to another episode of The Forest. Now before I get into it, I'd like to say I apologize. Today's video is going to be a little bit shorter only because today is Mother's Day and here's a fun fact if you guys didn't know this. My mom actually doesn't even live in the same country, not even the same continent as I do. And for once, she's actually here on Mother's Day. So I want to spend time with my mom. She actually lives in Europe. She lives in Portugal. So, uh, yeah, I apologize for that. But, uh, you know, regular length videos will be back tomorrow. But in today's episode, guys, what we want to do is talk about a Q&A that End Night Games actually posted on the official uh, forums for the game. Now, they talked about what's going to be coming in the zero point up team. 0. Up teen. that's good English, in the 0. 0.18 update, I think I hear a cannibal trying to be sneaky. Oh no, they're lizards, it's just a bunch of lizards. Well, that's good. <laughs> Whoa, there's a lot of lizards here, I might be able to, I might be able to capitalize on this here real quick. Alright, so as you can see, we're actually really hungry and really thirsty. Uh, we have food, so we can... Actually, we, I think we have some food on our on our hangar, don't we? Oh, yeah, we have lots. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. Okay, and then as for food, do we have... Uh, I mean, water. Do we have any water in here? We do. Drink, drink, drink. There we go. Full hunger, full hydration. Beautiful. Now we can get into the, the, the topics of discussion here. So... Um, people were asking, so if you guys don't know this actually, uh, every month or around every month, uh, the developers of this game, End Night Games, they go in and they do a Q&A to kind of, you know, well, it's a question and answer, just to answer community questions. And this time they really got to the nitty gritty. Sometimes they're uh, a little vague about, you know, some of the updates and stuff. And that makes sense. You know, they're not going to, you know, blatantly come out and say, you know, this is what we're adding to the game or blah, blah, blah. Ooh, gotcha. That might be two now, right? Is that two? Yeah, now we got a pouch. We can actually hold berries in it, so that's good. And let me uh let me reset this. This thing is oh hey, I got a lizard. <laughs> I got a lizard in my rabbit trap, guys. <laughs> Perfect. A little more armor isn't it could never hurt anybody. So this time they were actually pretty direct about what's gonna be in the update, so I'm gonna read a little bit here. Alright, so they said the reason why this update wasn't that large in terms of content is because they were working on a lot of bug fixes and didn't actually get to spend enough time on content. So what they actually wanted to do is wait an extra month and release a really content heavy patch. Those are the exact words they use there, so that's exciting. Uh, open up another side of the map, connect more of the cave system, and get an all new custom building elements that we've been working on to add in a few new gameplay systems and surprises. We've been reworking the terrain and layout of the world, and we're really excited for the improved islands around the map. Small blobs of terrain in the current build have been dressed and improved, along with a fixed raft system that will provide a really fun place to construct bases. So basically, in the next update, which is in about three weeks, uh, we're going to have a new island that we can sail to with improved sailing mechanics. As you guys know, the sailing right now is a little bit iffy, but uh, you know, maybe this season we can even go ahead and build a houseboat or... Um, just a raft or something to be prepared for for next season uh but the fact that they're finally expanding the map after 18 updates which is roughly around it's been about a year actually since this game's been out uh and we've been stuck on this island and now we're finally going to be able to expand into other islands and one thing that really actually gets me excited is when they said connect more of the cave system to me, that means being able to explore behind the open doors and see what is finally back there. So that's very, very exciting. Really quickly, I want to go ahead and what do we want to do? Explosives? What? Let's do a weapon rack. We'll do a weapon rack and let's go ahead and place this inside. That way we're at least doing something this episode rather than just talking. Although I don't think just talking is necessarily bad, especially when you get great news like this. But let's go ahead and... Oh, we already had all 10. Yeah, perfect. And then we can even put some of our... We can put our... Can we put this on here? Yeah, we can. Doop. I want this, though. I do I do want this axe. So we can put this axe away. And... Um, upgraded stick. Can this be put away? It can be. It's just a stick. Okay, that's good. <laughs> And then let's go ahead and build a medicine cabinet as well. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, damn it. I rotated it a little too much. 
Just a little too much, Andrew. It would help if it wasn't like, okay, I derped again. We're going to put it like, we're going to put it like right here. There we go. Ta-da! So it's six logs. We can go start cutting down a tree, and then we can work on that. So um, that's very exciting, and I, I truly do believe that there's going to be a nice big story piece added for us. Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and read uh, read another little. It, th there was a lot of really good a lot of really good pieces here. Maybe I'll split it up between a couple videos. It says here on the audio side we had professional recordings for all the cannibals done in the last few months. We're hoping to get all these recordings in for this upcoming patch. Two actresses we actually brought in for the female character, as we know, Beth, um, are Heather Dorkson, who starred in Pacific Rim, which is, you know, very high budget movie, and uh, Ashley Ball, who did a voice for My Little Pony. So these are two high level voice actresses who came in and recorded all types of different voice acting and noises and grunts and screeches and growls and all types of awesomeness that's going to improve the you know the overall feeling of this game so that's always a nice thing to see um both did a really great job and i'm hoping out hoping that they will bring the cannibal creatures to life hearing them giggle as they stalk you in the distance is terrifying i could only imagine that would be absolutely terrifying especially since beth's our favorite character right guys like you know, Beth, Beth is, we love Beth in this community. So Beth is getting an overhaul is always great news for us. Uh, Caves will be seeing a much, a bunch of improvements gameplay wise. We envision them as a stealth slash combat sections where you need to supply yourself head down, well prepared. And we're finally getting a chance to balance the combat and difficulty and the improve the enemies in the cave pathfinding as well. And it says here in brackets, as well as open and reveal some new cave systems. So there we go. Uh, that's why I truly, truly believe that we're going to be able to see finally what is behind that door, guys. And that's going to be very, very exciting to see what is back there. You know, it might even be nothing for now. It might just be more caves to explore and stuff. But even just, I feel like even just that, even just them opening that up and allowing us to go behind those doors. Because who knows what's even behind those doors. There could be something else even cooler back there that we can, you know, start really, really getting into as well. It, it, it's just amazing that the last couple of updates we've been actually, you know, blessed with all these cool opportunities to kind of ramble on about what could happen to the, to the, for, uh, the future of the forest. Oh, well, here we go. Actually, the very last line in the in the first answer says, finally, that big metal door deep down in the caves, you'll be able to open that in this upcoming patch. So there we go, guys. Confirmed. You will be able to go behind the doors in the upcoming patch. That's very exciting news. Um, I want you guys right now in the comments to start rehashing what you guys think is behind those doors and how freaking exciting is it that you will be able to actually finally get behind those doors. But guys, like I said, today's video was going to be short, and I really do apologize for that. But, you know, the videos from, you know, every day on will be back to normal. I'm sorry. I got to go to dinner with my mom. Happy Mother's Day if you're a mom. Or let your mother know I said happy Mother's Day. I get, hey, mom, Andrew Oscar Delta said happy Mother's Day. And she'll just be like, who is that? <laughs> but guys, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and a wonderful weekend. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I love your faces. Bye-bye.